Oak Island is a place that's far beyond the ordinary. When you step into the sandy shores of South Nova Scotia, Canada, it's like the earth itself is hiding the secret of the ancients from you. Even the winds in the trees whisper ancient stories and hold deep mysteries. In this video, we dive into the shocking discoveries hidden in nature's stash. Get ready for an extraordinary journey as we dig into incredible finds in the depth of Oak Island's past. 1797, Cartwheel Penny. For centuries, the mystery of Oak Island has intrigued treasure hunters. Up until the new hunters Rick and Marty Lagina, no treasure had been found. However, the Laginas found some cool old stuff after spending over a decade at the island alongside those before them. First on our list of discoveries is this 1797 cartwheel penny. In the hushed shadows of Oak Island, Gary Drayton, metal detector expert and author, unearthed a relic frozen in time he found a 1797 cartwheel penny featuring the stoic image of King George III. Oh boy, what could this even mean? This unassuming find is a tangible link to life in the 18th century. It plays a key role in the mystery that is Oak Island. How did it even get there, for one? This coin was in use up until the late 1860s. This discovery of a little messenger from the past shook through the island's mysteries. Garnet Pin. Speaking of little treasures, this next discovery seems like a minuscule one. However, as this next discovery is tiny, it urges one to be curious about what other jewels could be hidden in this trove. This time a gemstone brooch was unearthed, resembling a garnet pin from the 16th century. The Laginas and their team discovered this tiny garnet pin, the island's first cherished relic. Its intricate design feels like a nudge at untold tales. As the gem's dull sparkle mirrored centuries past, one cannot just help but pose the lingering question. What other treasures lay hidden as Oak Island continues to guard its secrets? Copper Artifact. A peak product of mystery from the list of discoveries is a copper artifact found in 2022. Etched with enigmatic symbols, it's almost like a small piece of something grand nobody knows about just yet. This top pocket discovery, rich in copper with traces of iron and zinc, puzzles even the most renowned archaeologist doctor, Edwin Barnhart. Speculating a connection to 16th century European religious leaders, he also entertains the tantalizing notion of a Viking origin. This adds layers of mystery to the find. What ancient tales does it carry, and what civilizations left their mark on Oak Island to be discovered after such a long time? Keyhole. Next up is another product of metal detection. The discovered keyhole plate is an intricate piece. Its form suggests craftsmanship and purpose, with details that capture the eye. The metal, weathered by time, adds an air of antiquity. The keyhole itself appears both functional and ornamental, and this leaves room for imagination about the lock once secured. One can only speculate about the chests it might have safeguarded and the secrets it may still hold underneath the layers of Oak Island's history. This discovery hints at untold mysteries for sure. Could this keyhole be a fragment from a chest akin to Captain Anderson's sea chest? The answers to these questions linger in the mysterious Oak Island. Shakespeare pieces. They dug deep, about 160 feet deep in the money pit, and guess what they found? A combo of old parchment and leather book binding. Now, the wild part, this discovery is resurrecting this theory that Shakespeare's original works might be stashed on the island. Alongside vegetable tanned leather binding, they stumbled upon a chunk of purple stained wood, giving off the fancy old school feel. Shakespeare's actual masterpieces could really be hiding in Oak Island. The mystery's alive, and those sheets might just tell the buried secrets of the bard. French military cap badge. Next up, they found this French military cap badge, and it might be from a French soldier's hat back in the 1700s. Talk about digging up history. Word is, it could link to the Duke d'Anville expedition of 1746. You know, that big French attempt to swipe Nova Scotia from the British, led by someone from the fancy La Rochefoucauld family? The whole thing disappeared mysteriously. Now this badge adds a new layer of mystery. Is it a clue to the Duke d'Anville story? Or does Oak Island have more hidden tales waiting to spill out? The plot thickens, really. Samuel Ball's Slave Tag. 
In addition, there's this tag with ball carved into it. This was also found on Oak Island. Surprise twist? It might have belonged to Samuel Ball, a former enslaved person who hit the jackpot and became a big deal landowner in Nova Scotia. Now, the burning question. Is it possible Ball stumbled upon the treasure everyone's after? This tag discovery feels like cracking open a mystery. From Samuel Ball's slavery days, could there be an untold story about him and Oak Island? The intrigue leaves us to wonder. What if this name tag spills the beans on Ball's link to the island's legendary riches? Stone Well. There's an old stone well out in the Wild West that is Oak Island. It's more than half a mile from the famous money pit. And here's the crazy part. It never freezes during winter. Some say it might be a huge 800 years old, or even older. What's wilder is it's the only spot outside the money pit area, where water tests show a bunch of silver. It's such a puzzling one. What's going on with this ancient well? What's it been hiding all these years, and why does it laugh in the face of winter? The mystery's thick, making us wonder about the secrets Oak Island's holding onto. 1652. Spanish Maravedi. Next up on the list, the Laginas and their crew stumbled upon this copper coin, the Spanish Maravedi from 1652. They found it in the swamp during their first season. It's like a time-traveling hint that things were going down on Oak Island way before the famous money pit found in 1795. It's so easy to imagine them brushing off ancient mud, thinking, who dropped this coin and what was happening here back then? Gold-plated button. Now, guess what was dug up on Oak Island? Only a gold-plated military officer's button. This bling of a find adds to the pile of military stuff they've uncovered. Get this. It's suggesting that Oak Island's underground structures might be leftovers from the 18th at the Earth century British military. Imagine spotting this golden button, gleaming in the dirt. The mystery is absolutely thrilling at this point. What if this shiny button tells on some military history? Human bone. Here's one thing you definitely did not see coming. An unexpected find surfaced deep within the money pit excavation on Oak Island. Human bones dating back to the 17th century. DNA analysis unveiled a curious twist, narrating the stories of two individuals, one with roots in Europe and the other from the Middle East. The possible identities behind these bones are mind-blowing. It's absolutely wild. Gold in the money pit. In 2022, Professor of Earth and Environmental Science, Dr. Ian Spooner and his team looked into the money pit on Oak Island. Guess what they found? Gold. But not just any gold. It's like a secret stash buried 80 to 120 feet underground, in an area they call the Baby Blob. Their excitement as they discovered this mysterious gold spot must have been over the top. What's the story behind it? How did it get there? And why is it in that specific area? 95 foot deep tunnel. While trying to figure out where all the precious metals in the money pit of Oak Island come from, the team hit the literal jackpot. They found this mysterious tunnel at 95 feet deep in three different spots. Of course, here's the wild part. It runs right under the garden shaft and through the baby blob, where they detected a bunch of gold and silver traces. The sheer excitement when they uncovered this secret tunnel. What's it doing there? What's its story? Lead cross. Like it's not all crazy enough, they found a big lead cross at Smith's Cove of Oak Island and it's a total game changer. Tests say the lead comes from southern France and goes way back to the 1300s or 1400s. This cross isn't just any old thing. It hints that the Knights Templar just might have been out on Oak Island. It simply keeps getting more interesting. Hinge. In a gripping revelation, Gary Drayton stumbled upon a wrought iron hinge. Tests place its origins between the early 1600s and 1700s, suggesting it might have secured a substantial door. This sparks speculation. Could this be the hinge to a long-lost treasure chest? The grand secrets from this iron relic could be an important piece in the puzzle of Oak Island's history. With this mysterious hinge, who knows really? French drains. Next up, this one's quite the mystery. A man-made drain that's like an ancient water magic trick. No pumps or pipes, just rocks cleverly placed to control water flow. What an ancient plumbing system. Who figured this out way back when, and what for? 
Simply try to picture the island's past, where someone cleverly crafted this drain without modern tools. What if it holds clues to the island's oldest tales? Box Drain The next thing discovered on Smith's Cove on Oak Island seems like a possible door to one of the five ancient drains. Back in 1850, the Truro Company stumbled upon these mysterious drains, thinking they might connect to a sneaky plan, flooding the money pit as a clever trap. Imagine the suspense as they uncovered this maybe door to an old drain. Silver in the money pit. Now, in the same baby blob, water tests spilled the beans, a good stash of silver hiding deep down the money pit. Where did all this silver come from? And why exactly was it stashed away? It's enough to start thinking about the stories locked in with this buried treasure. At this point, it's like a real life treasure hunt. Lead bag seal. In yet another captivating moment, a lead cloth bag seal was unearthed, adorned with mysterious marks that might link back to the Templars. The symbols are intricate and mysterious. What stories do those strange symbols tell? And could this seal be a clue to the Templars being connected to Oak Island? With this, it feels like opening a door to hidden tales, wrapped in the mystery of Templar secrets. 15th century wooden cargo barrels. Parts of an ancient wooden cargo barrel dating back to the 15th century were also uncovered in the swamp investigation. It could be fragments from a barrel that once held a piece of the Oak Island treasure. The mystery's real, and we're left with lots of what ifs. All these discoveries are like opening hidden chapters in the island's story. Oak Island's past is like a big book slowly opening up. Ever wondered where pirates of old hid their treasure? If you enjoyed this video, dive deeper into the secrets by watching our video about how Captain Kidd became the king treasure hunter of Oak Island on the channel. There are still hundreds of ancient wonders, mystery stories we are willing to uncover on Mystery Unity. If you enjoyed this video, subscribe so you don't miss them. See you in the next video.